And welcome back to another episode of X4 Foundations. Let's um, carry on. Um, so we're here outside the ship. Uh, let's jump in and see if we can grab some missions or something. Discoverer Vanguard. Right, my dear sir, jump on the uh, that how unfortunate mission over there. They want us to do deploy six mines. Yeah, we're not doing that. Let's uh, let's jump on the highway and uh, head that way around. So yeah, early game, I don't know, we're just kind of scavenging, I mean I might be able to actually afford a new uh, new ship right now really, um, to get to Argon Prime really. Let's see, supply over there, what do they want? And a lockbox, actually we can do that one, 174, whoops. Just uh, jump off this uh, one and try and get back over there. Wow, well, there's a bit of a bit of a fight going on here. Wow, serious incursion. We got a Xenon defense platform here as well. Wowza. Anyway, let's um, get out of here. Um, if we can find that, so yeah, silent witnesses all going on. So they want resources. Here we go. Supply and recovery. Find a lockbox. Hundred and seventy-four thousand. We'll we'll do it. Okay, let's. Uh, gonna automatically set that. So our destination. Let's uh, head over that way. Now the, uh, the thing with these lockbox missions is um, the box can spawn anywhere inside this sort of circle here. So uh, we've got to do a bit of scanning. It might be easier for me to jump on the highway and get over there actually. Let's try that. Certainly go a lot faster on the highway. Let's jump off there. Let's hold it about here. Let's try scanning for it. I think we can do close now for it, unfortunately. See if that scan did pick it up. No, it did. Wow, okay, picked up both of them. Okay, let's go for that one there. Target that again. Where is it? Can't see it anyway. Did that not target it? Bring it over there. Yeah, I'm not sure if we need two lock boxes. It's usually just one, but uh, we'll see. Get ready to slow down. Kilometer. Yep. Okay. So. Now you can sometimes shoot these with your uh, with your ship. Um, I've found the guns a bit 
unruly before. Switch to just one, but anyway, I'm just gonna get up and uh, oh, we haven't got any guns on our spacesuit yet. Hmm. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to try this then. No, I don't want to shoot that. The gun's like right over there. Try that one. Try this. Good stuff. Both of them up. Wow, well, that was quite easy. Okay, the oh, box. I messed this up, and I shoot the uh, cargo container. Won't be happy. Uh, I need to be extremely careful because I need the guns do go a bit funny around these little lock boxes. And uh, there we go. Zoom on to this one. Yeah, I would kind of like to head off to uh, Zenon Space and uh, we can make a bit more money over there. But uh, it's obviously kind of dangerous, so I would like to upgrade my ship a little bit first. I think we've got the money to do that, so right, let's touch this. What do you mean doing really stupid? There you go. What is this gun sight doing? There we go. Good stuff. So there we go, there's another easy uh, 174,000 credits. Let's uh, jump. Now I want to cover oh, just a few stations. Okay. Let's set our guidance over there. Uh, getting turned around quite a bit here. And then let's zoom over there. And uh, I really want to get to Argon Prime, then we can uh, upgrade this ship, possibly even buy a new one. But um, we'll see what's what when we get over there, really. Uh, I think there's some asteroids and stuff over there that uh, might be a bit better than these. No. Jump out. Cancel. Direction we're sort of going, so going to the right hand one. Jump on it here. Wow. That guy's on the wrong lane. Well, the left hand one went uh, the other way, but anyway. Let's see. That lane basically went behind us. As this lane sort of goes that way, and we missed it. Or it's not a valid entry point for the team. I do find these uh, hitboxes for these are a little bit wonky sometimes. Now and again, really. And this is the wrong one. Now, after all that, jump onto this one. Yeah, they seem to have these blobs you just saw there intermittently on them. That uh, that seems to be where you can sort of attach and detach from these. But anyway, let's check we're going the right way. Yeah, we are. Okay, bit of a choice. I think it's over here. This is this is a this is a big ringway. Entering system. A tick bus choice. Yeah, definitely all kicking off there. Super highway there. 
that one is it? Chump Gate. Yeah, I'll run it when come back here when we're uh, ready to ship. So I'm looking for um well it's not here but um two defences, no. Probably hired help. Oh there's a repair for data leaks. Dear. But um Anyway, here we are with Argon Prime, and that's where we want to be. That dock just we just passed. So, see if we can slide off of here and get there. Very good. Let's see if we can just zoom right into the entrance. Uh, recommends me. Uh, I don't know about doing the upgrade tutorial, but I would like to stick a satellite down here. So let's zoom over the side here so we're out of the way a little bit. And deploy a satellite. Yep. Well, hopefully, it's not too close to affect our ship's docking and stuff. But, um, should be alright. Right, let's go and dock. Wow, oh, it's busy. Anyway, this is the larger size dock. You can probably tell. So, where's it going to want us to dock? Over there. Okay. That's perfect. Forwards a little bit. There we go. Right. And automatic docking. Cool. So, what we want to do is upgrade our dock ships here. So, let's. Um, much money. Apparently, he's not added any. It's fine. Okay, shield generators. What are we running? Probably really afford a Mark III. Um, well, I would like better thrusters as well. Go for the combat one, Mark II. Um, engine. Yeah, let's go for the travel one. That's what we're going to be using the most. And we want a docking computer. Do I want a full on docking computer? Maybe. It makes landing a little bit easier. But it's not really necessary. I would like the trading expansion. The targeting one as well. So. Stick all that on my shopping list. No, total price is going to be 264. And we've got. Uh, 354 so we're doing all right we're going to be uh, a little bit tight on money but um let's uh let's upgrade that then uh, i think what i might do is head off to xenon space and see if we can find some juicy juicy asteroids to scan and uh, get some crystals out of so. Well, that's uh, well, that's going on. Is it's going to take a little while? Let's um, let's go and sell these uh, sedatives and bandages and and whatnot. So let's uh, let's get up. Discoverer Vanguard. And uh, go around here. Okay. 
Yeah, but there's nobody here. Fantastic. Great. Oh. That's a bit of a shame. I don't think we can make anything at all with any of these. We can make hallucinogens, okay. <laughs> I don't know what first aid kits. Well, we could actually craft a first aid kit. Yeah, make one. Oh, can we make? Well, we make four. Let's just make all four then. I don't think I've ever made any of these before. But anyway, they're worth ten thousand as opposed to the bits and pieces that were worth before. Maybe even as much as forty-two thousand. But uh, unfortunately, we can't sell them here. Um, these speakers, I don't know if you can hear the music here. Sometimes the music is a bit better than these, than this, but uh, it's okay. But uh, unfortunately, it only comes out of the speakers. I wish there were some more speakers around because sometimes it's a bit more atmospheric, really. Anyway, let's pop back to our Discovery Vanguard. And uh, let's see how we're doing on the upgrades. And we are free, so good stuff. Let's uh, go now. So the travel drive will help us um, let's just boost out of here. Press tab. Right. Using your boost does use your shields up. If I tab again, if you look here, our shields are going down quite dramatically. Um, so you've got to use them a bit sparingly. But um, let's find that. So that uh, jump gate over there, go and start guidance there. Autopilot engaged. Let's go. Yeah, uh, Zen on space is, is dangerous, but. Uh, Deadly versus reward, really. Whoa! Okay. Well, we're having a major graphics glitch there. One thing, uh, thing I have found is you can do Shift S to save the game. And then uh, do that. Let's hope it doesn't crash. So let me just quickly save. System. I take bus but, uh, yeah. Basically, the problem I have with this game is yeah, you just get these bizarre graphical glitches. I wonder if that's going to put us off. I'm amazed that Xenons have this defensive thing there. That's really concerning. Anyway, it's going to cause a bit of a bit of a fight going on here. Let's so, jump off the. Uh, Thing and try and get over there. Nope, I went through the gate anyway. Oh well, our inertia carried us through. Let's uh, boost back again then. Yeah, you can sort of slingshot yourself quite a bit. Especially when you're going at 9,000 on one of those Gotta maintain your speed for a bit. Whoa, there's a big one there. What's this guy here? Oh, that's the biggest um, Xenon ship I've ever seen, actually. Yeah. Yeah, there's a big old fight here. So let's get out of here. So, there's a Xenon highway over there. Somewhere. See. Yeah, currently every Xenon in the whole place over here, especially all of these guys is now you can see aimed straight for our ship. So let's uh let's set guidance down there. See where that is. Okay. Yep, good for Xenon. But as long as I keep my speed up we should be okay. Just need to get away from these guys a little bit. Dang 
Danger. Hazardous region detected. Yep, no kidding. Right. Base. Big uh, raiding party over there. Nice big center on the station. Don't really want to go near, thank you. So, let's zoom over here. Wow, I think my shields are actually going down from this hazardous region, actually. Might be sucking my shields. Uh, head like, I don't know, away from these guys. Let's go over there. Wow, my shields are really dropping. Bad news. Yep, not good. We need to get out of this uh, lightning area. I don't think we're going to survive. Just head back to normal space. The shields are out, so we're now going to start taking hull damage probably. Not good. Not in danger has this region anymore, but anyway. Jump in here and get our shields back. Excuse me, Zen on ship. Yeah, I bet they're requesting immediate backup. Uh, let's pull up over here. Good, shields are coming back. There. Let's, uh, let's jump back in there again. Yeah, let's try and maybe just going straight across the system and see if there's another, there's another zone. I think there should be. But, um, But you know what? I'm just going to stop here actually and let's repair our ship. To repair our ship, we need to just jump into our spacesuit here and use our little repair laser on it. So, target it. Target the ship. We can't not target it. Requesting immediate backup. I'll get my ship. All oh, 18. Oh, there we go. You did do it. Okay. Yep. So over on the right. So there we go. You can see the repair lasers. Pretty cool. Let's dock again. All right. Yeah, that's causing a bit of a barney over there. I wonder if they destroyed all these other ships. You can see the defense station one, well, there's quite a few destroyed ones. Just hold up here actually. I'll we'll see if there's any uh, any interesting things on the radar. Yeah, it doesn't look like it sadly. What's that? There's a container there. Container. Yep, what does it contain? One credit, that's it. There's another one over there. Base fly eggs, high energy catalyst. Container. Let's take the high energy catalyst one. Base fly eggs are, are sort of illegal. So, uh, let's see if we can pick these up. Yeah, I wish the uh, I wish the loot was a bit easier to spot, really. In these tiny little containers. Yeah, that is a very, very big ship. Obviously, uh, 
new patches uh, change the war a bit. Pick that up now. There we go, high energy uh, right. catalyst so that can create cooling mods. Wow, there's uh, there's a lot of debris out here. What's that? Basic weapon chamber. Bit hard to see with all these other wrecks around. That guy's getting whacked. What we got? Basic ship nano weave, high energy catalyst. Tuning software. That sounds good. Go for the tuning software. Hopefully that big uh, battleship over there won't be too interested in us. It looks like it might be in range. I might have to do a very fast little flyby here. Um, let's turn our scoop. No, it wasn't enough. And keep this cam camera on that thing. No. Ah, oh, come on. All right, let's uh, let's just grab it and I'll slow down and uh, really. Why is the vacuum not working? Let's slow it right down there. Right on top of it. There we go. The other one is right here somewhere. Let's come to a complete stop. There we go. Micro gimbal. Yeah, uh, there's certainly a bit of a barn again on out here. What we got? Vidium crystallite. Container. That sounds kind of uh, expensive to me. Let's go. Not about for a machine. I you. Good. Got that. What have we got? Wow, not really worth much, but anyway. I was, I was expecting the Iridium Crystallite to be worth a bit more than that. But um, anyway. Well, let's carry on with our mission and uh, try and explore some more Xenon space. And so let's head to our target there. He's getting there very close to that guy. It's only four kilometers away. He's probably going to be shooting at us. If I can rotate the camera, he didn't shoot at us for some reason. But anyway. Right. Just keep on trucking. Yeah, I don't know how far this region extends, really. But yeah, it's chomping my shields down already. Hopefully it doesn't cover this whole area. Yeah, we can do 5,000 now, which is a bit faster, so we should be able to evade a lot of this stuff, really. As long as I keep moving, we'll be alright. Well, I'm still in this dangerous area. Shame, my plan here was come here and try and scan these rocks over here. But anyway. Danger. Hazardous region. Looks like this area's been made hazardous region. Just to stop people farming it, I suppose. But anyway. It's slightly that way. The 
coming out of the hazardous region, but uh, it's also out of the mining area. Now we're in the clear. We should be gaining some uh, shields now. A few shields going up. Yeah, there we go. Stuff. Right, well, at least we know we can get to a safe area. Let's head to. Uh, Take their, uh, their highway again. This is between systems, so I mean you might be able to just fly between systems. I'm not sure. Um. Anyway, let's uh, let's go and take their highway just to be sure. But uh, this next system won't be uh, as nasty as this one. But yeah, usually there's a big fight going on in the entrance to this system, so down here at the jump gate really, that whole area there, but uh, not for the moment, so oh, this is hazardous area. Okay. Danger. Hazardous region detected. What a shame. No. Get over there. Ten. Slide sideways into it, I guess. Right. Never. Funny glitch there. Entering Barkov Cascade seventeen. Okay, this looks more promising. So we do have a couple of ships on us there, but I might be able to just outrun them. Get some speed going. Yeah, I'm not seeing any electrostatic stuff going on around here, so should be okay. As long as I can get away from that guy. Right. Go a bit further just to be sure. Uh, lots and lots of very juicy asteroids. Apparently there's a parent in trouble somewhere around here. Now they're closer to this group over here. Right, so back in episode one we were looking for Plenty things on asteroids. So uh, let's uh, let's resume because uh, the glinty things on these asteroids are certainly worth a lot more. Oh, was that one there? Let's see if it comes back. Yeah, there we go. Just there. again for me. Where is it? There it is. There. Here we go. Asteroid. Spinning a bit here which is going to make it a little bit more annoying but anyway. Okay. Very annoying. See if I can suck these guys along. Give me some crystals. Yeah. Yeah, controlling this thing is pretty interesting. Come here, crystals. What have we got? Bandanite. Well, it's not the most uh, expensive of uh, things, I don't think. Let's have a look. And the night crystal. There, well, we've got 11 of them. 
No, there's a hundred thousand. Let's see uh, if we can find some more. Oops, I think we're actually inside the asteroid now. We've clipped inside the asteroid. Fantastic. If we can squeeze out. Again. Yep. Not the best, but anyway, let's, uh, let's spot some more. I saw one down there, but only a short, short little glint, so no. There you go, here, so let's boost on to the next section. One ginty asteroids, that's what we want. Well, hopefully I'm not missing too many. Funny, when you're uh, when you're not when you're watching these videos back you seem to spot them all. But uh, when you're actually playing it, it's quite tricky. I don't know. I'm not seeing any at the moment, so... I think that one just there. Yep. Or well, maybe it's on this little one. Yeah, it's on this little asteroid. Um, slow down. Try and stop there. Right there it is. Oh, there's another hundred grand. Oh, yeah, graphical lag there. Anyway, we're, we're about 40 minutes in, so I think we're getting near the end of the episode. If we can find some more. Yeah, Bandai isn't super, uh, super expensive. Uh, there are some very expensive whale we're having one coming in on radar. Are you tracking us? No, but that one might be. So we'll have to be a bit careful here. Unfortunately, they, uh, they have better normal speed drives. We can outrun them at. Um, sort of super fast travel mode speeds so uh, they will outrun us at normal cruising speed unfortunately
Nope, very, uh, very sparse on the ground here. Well, let's um, let's call the episode here, I think, and uh, so join you next time, and uh, we shall carry on searching for very expensive crystals. Hopefully, crossing my fingers. Anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, hopefully see you guys again soon. So take care.